Alright gamers, so this is kind of like a fucking rant video on uh, the bugs and shit in Destiny 2 and like all the fucking like problems we've been having with this shit because uh, it's kind of fucked. Um, I mean Bungo's like kind of like trying to fix like Beaver and shit and all these different error codes and the fucking 101 ways to get fucking removed from the game in Destiny. I mean, literally, there could be a fucking video on that, dude. It's like fucking Fallout 76 level of bullshit. Like, Jesus Christ. I mean, you know there's a problem with your game when you're getting fucking removed from a match like 15 times in a row. Or when a raid just can't happen or Petra's run gets fucked up because someone gets, like, auto-kicked. Or not auto-kicked, but fucking beavered out of the fucking game. I mean, Bungo is having a serious problem with bugs in their game. And, uh, it's kind of bad. Like, I mean, a game... Like, a multiplayer game is really only good if you can actually fucking play it without getting kicked from it. I mean, getting, like, like in TF2, getting kicked by fucking, like, your friends fucking around in a public match, kicking you and, like, not expecting to go through is one thing. But, like, when you're just constantly getting fucking removed from a game for a bug on the server side, I mean, it's kind of fucking horrible. Not to mention that, I mean, Bungo really doesn't have their act together on keeping, like, online play like safe and fun i mean they don't really have a solid anti-cheat like most multiplayer games do and so it's kind of just like when you're playing trials or um or even normal pvp for that fact i mean you run into people who are using fucking perfect aim and all kinds of other bullshit which can be really annoying and i mean it's it's all it's like the csgo scenario the game went free and a fucking ton of hackers flooded it but, I mean, CSGO at least has anti-cheat. Bungie has not implemented any kind of anti-cheat into Destiny, and so, I mean, what the fuck's the holdup on that? There's plenty of anti-cheats that can probably be blended into the game or used without really a lot of effort. And it would definitely, like, it would make the experience a whole lot better for playing Trials when you're not fucking six victories and then you fucking run into a full team of cheaters fucking you win six matches and then you just fucking flawless the rest of the match and then you lose your ticket i mean it's really kind of fucked because even if you're good at pvp sometimes you just fucking lose to hackers and i mean that's a really kind of annoying problem it's gotten a little bit better but it over the last couple like weeks and shit bungie's been trying but really i mean they're kind of trying half-assed to fix all these problems that they've really kind of created i mean season of the beaver i mean season of worthy but that was one thing i mean it's a whole nother thing when bungo says yeah we've uh we've uh made beaver a little bit better because they released a tweet um not entirely too long ago maybe a week or two and um they said yeah we kind of made some bug patches and that well Shit's fucking wrong, dude. Same day, fucking streamers and that were all ranting about getting beavered like 15 times. Made such a, like, not noticeable difference that, like, no one fucking cared. In fact, I think it made a lot of people more angry. And, I mean, it was so funny that fucking my friend posted a video of a fucking SFM that was literally just fucking screaming at a beaver. I mean, that's literally the state of the Destiny 2 community for, fuck, it's been a couple months almost now since beaver became a fucking really big problem and it kind of annoys the shit out of me and i mean i I've, I've kind of even like stopped playing destiny over the last two days just because like i've been like fuck this i've been like no i'm kind of just done with this shit i'm waiting until the next expansion next uh raid i'm just kind of waiting it out at this point and it's specifically because of the fucking bugs and because of the lack of kind of like really like interesting new content i mean i'm very happy with the or the dungeon they added in recently prophecy is a really fun dungeon but i mean honestly it's kind of getting a little stale and with no addition of bug patches or fucking anti-sheet i'm just kind of like well i'm just gonna wait it out until shit gets better so uh anyway yeah that's kind of just a short little rant on that shit trying to stream on twitch every day not streaming this weekend or this week but uh try and get into the groove of streaming every day and uh i'm trying to make more uploads on youtube maybe but for the most part it's kind of just like uh uh every once in a while i'm gonna upload when i feel like it so yeah
and then we have Smite over there who fucking said he's back like six months ago. He's not uploaded a single video. You know, I fucking go ahead and subscribe and uh, yeah, wait for the next uh, shit post or whatever. And I'll talk to you all later.